Hey, Douglas Peacock here. Welcome to today's call. Hope you had an awesome weekend and are enjoying this cool weather if you're in the Southern Hemisphere. And no doubt if you're in the Northern Hemisphere, she's starting to warm up and life's getting pretty good. So today I want to just touch on the energy of accountability and your ability to take account for your actions. What are you doing? How are you getting about? And this is a great time of the year, you know, halfway through June. Half the year's gone already. And how are you going? If you looked at your action steps for the first half of the year, are you taking um, accountability for what you've got done? Are you on track? Are you wanting to achieve things? How's your health? How's your uh, finances? How's your relationships? When we look at the energy of uh, accountability and we step into the power of it, we're able to... Um, take responsibility for what's actually really going on because one of the things that uh, what happens is we get caught up in our uh, mind uh, and emotions and hold ourselves back and what we need to become aware of hold on do I have a measuring stick can I do I know where I started from and where I'm going to and how am I going along the journey are you able to take responsibility for everything you do or do you blame others do you blame situations is there always an excuse or is there is there a reason why you're not achieving what you're wanting to achieve and when we peel all that back we can come back to the pureness of what's actually the truth and when we step into that place and we grow from there creating the life that we want to create being everything that we want to do we step into a place of power and we step in a place of loving kindness to just being in this beautiful flow with the universe and we stay in joy. So one of the things when we look at, hold on, what am I accountable for? What, am I, what do I have the ability to take account for? When it comes to my actions, am I ability, do, do I have the ability to see where I may be dysfunctional, where I'm not taking the right action steps, where I'm getting distracted, where I'm procrastinating? Or have I got the ability to take care and move into the powerful place of saying, wow, I'm here and I'm now taking it to there? Whereabouts are you? So in the area of your relationships, how's your accountability there? How's your ability to take account for how are you showing up in the relationship? Do Are you going out and spending time with your partner? Or are you just taking everything for granted, leaving it to someone else? What about family? Are you doing your part to keep the connection going and, and having the joy and the, the love of, amongst family members? Or do you leave it to someone else? When it comes to your uh, money, are you being accountable for that? Are, are you taking the, having the ability to see where your taxes are, see where your um, growth is, where you may be leaking money? Are you able to do that? Are you doing that? Or are you holding yourself back and leaving it for someone else? Or putting your head in the ground like an ostrich? What about in the, in the context of your health? Are you, do you have the ability to take see what action steps you're doing for there? Are you exercising? Are you eating well? Are you, you know, over drinking, over celebrating? There's nothing wrong with celebrating and having a good time, but there must be balance. And when, we, when we're accountable for what's going into our body and how we're showing up, we become so much more uh, precise and we become so much more clean in how we are. And then we feel good. So then we express that goodness out to everything else. And your mind... What are the thoughts in your mind? Are you accountable for the thoughts that you're having and the emotions that you're having? And it's slowing down and having the ability to watch what you're thinking and watch what you're feeling and taking responsibility for them. And it's the ability to sit in the truth, to sit in the peace, to sit in the, the loving kindness within. When we do that, we're free. And so when we look at our life, and we just have a look at the uh, taking a and, and the ability to um, take account. We get a very strong base to stabilize us to be able to take our steps. There's no right, there's no wrong. All we're doing is looking, observing. Then you've got a decision to make. 
Are you going to step up and um, make changes or are you going to keep going along where you're at? Not this right or wrong. It's up to you. It's your life. So, hey, just thought you'd, uh, that would be a nice little tip to help for the day to get your week started so that you can nail what you want to get done for the week and have the ability to take account for your actions, for the way you show up, for the way you feel about yourself, and uh, have a great week. So, blessings, enjoy, and I look forward to seeing you on Wednesday. Take care.